Lake Shore, and welcome to a week in review where we take a look at some stories you might have missed this week. A Michigan man has once again helped decorate the exterior of Lambeau Field ahead of their playoff game against the 49ers. Michael Sponholt and the rest of Team USA snow sculptors carved out several packed snow sculptures outside of the stadium. They've been doing this for every Packer home playoff game for the past several years. The Manitowoc community has stepped up big for some area families. First, in Kiel, a fundraiser was held at the girls' basketball game Monday night to support the family of a student who lost their house to a fire. Athletic Director Steve Walsh said the community came out in droves as they were able to collect $3,000 through a Pass the Hat fundraiser, while the school district donated the admin admission fees to the Lucas family. Then, in Manitowoc, Pet Skull Brewing and Sabbatical Brewing both held fundraisers for the family of an 8-year-old Skyler Rose Beatty who died January 5th in a car crash. Paul Hoffman from Pet Skull told us that his fundraiser raised three times what he expected. Skyler was a student at Valders Elementary School whose principal, Jason Prochno, told us they have some things planned to help honor her memory. Prochno was called, had called Skyler a very bright girl who always showed kindness to others. Also this week, we ran a five-part series on the Afghan refugees that are resettling in Green Bay. In the series, we spoke with two refugees, Abdullah and Ali, as well as interpreter Saeed Werdek, volunteer Mary Arnold, case manager Anilda Albiza, and the director of Catholic Charities, Carmen Lemke. You can visit cheyfernews.com to see what all of those people had to say. You can always find more local news online anytime at cheyfernews.com. You have yourself a fantastic weekend. Go Pack Go, and we'll see you next week.